What a gorgeous day today. It's a balmy 38, 39 degrees. We've still got some snow, fortunately, um, but it's melting fast. And my friend Rob Strauss at Rob's Performance invited me out to take a look and a ride of this new Lynx 3500 Rave. And I'm pretty excited about trying it. They're telling me that it's quite the machine and I'm going to give it a spin. But first, let's take a look at it. You can see I've got a Renegade XRS sitting right next to it, so you can kind of see the difference between the two sleds. The seat on the Skidoo goes all the way up to the gas tank filler. And on the uh, Rave, there's uh, a lot more exposure here in front of the uh, seat. I'm not going to go over a lot of the features because they've already been covered in a lot of videos that are already out. But I thought I'd just give you a quick overview. It's got the PPS suspension in the back here, which I guess has some monstrous weight transfer. And we have basically the same Razx type front suspension, but with the KYB 46 millimeter shocks with both high speed and low speed dampening adjustment and rebound. It's got the ultra low windshield on it. It's got these really nice wide single keel skis. And um, I guess it's really fun, so let's take it for a spin. Both sleds have the 1.5 inch ice ripper.
fun that was. The Lynx Rob A 3500. I gotta say a little bit more about these Blade X skis. They're, uh, they're wider than your Pilot X's, and they're a single keel. And boy, do they carve. Now, granted, this snow is it's warm out today. This snow is, uh, it hasn't gotten sloppy, but it's, uh, it's set up. But it's still kind of loosey goosey. It's not like fresh powder or anything. But these skis carve nice. There's a zero push. They, uh, as a matter of fact, they can get a little twitchy just because of some of the grooves from the other, uh, the other riders that have been down this trail. Not a negative, that's just the conditions. But um, I think I might try a set of these on my uh, XRS. They, uh, I'm liking the way they feel. So uh, I just wanted to throw that out there on those. What an awesome ride. This thing is just a lot of fun. Lot of fun factor. The transfer is incredible. This thing just wants to lift the skis and climb. Uh, the dealer put the uh, uh, limiter strap on number four and uh, it still wants to climb, but he said before they put it on four, it would stand it right up on the bumper without even trying. So, uh, again, just a lot of fun. The flickability, the uh, playfulness, it's really fun. This would be a sled for a guy that's, you know, going to do some off-trail ditch banging, maybe get some moguls. You ride this like you would ride a snowcross or a motocross type vehicle. Um, with the skis in the air, you're hitting the moguls with the track, and um, you're just kind of dancing it through the bumps. Um, as far as carving goes on the corners, you're going to want off the power, set the skis, and make your turn, because if you do a power on turn, those skis just want to come right back up, and then off you go straight ahead. So, um, other than that, what a great looking sled, too. Really awesome. I really like it. I'm glad that uh, Rob called me last night and gave me the opportunity to come out and try it. Again, the Lynx Rob A-R-E 3500 means 3,500 millimeters. What a fun sled. Hope to see you guys out on the trails, and if you're interested in one of these, um, just get a hold of your local Skidoo dealer. I'm sure they'll have one waiting for you.